We are back at Disney Springs for our first episode of What's New Number 2 Off-Planet Edition. Yes, we can visit World of Disney or the Star Wars Trading Post for some Star Wars merch. But there's one place nestled right in the middle of Disney Springs that has some super cool Star Wars merch. We're talking the Lego Store. Welcome everyone to Disney Springs and our first episode of What's New and Batu Off Planet Edition. Before we head into the Lego store, consider subscribing to our channel, hit that thumbs up, and make sure your notifications are on so you're all set for your weekly updates. The idea for this video came from Paul B3151, who left a comment on our last video. What's the Star Wars Lego stuff like at Disney Springs? Well, we're going to show you this week. Before we head inside the Lego store, I had to stop by these five amazing Lego statues outside the store. Make sure if you visit here to take your picture with Rey, the giant Chewbacca, Kylo Ren looks like he's ready for his next battle, Next to Kylo Ren is a Sith Trooper. The detail on these statues is crazy. Absolutely done by Lego Master Builders. The last one is Captain Phasma. Lego does change these out from time to time. Because I recall last time we were here there was a BB-8 next to Rey. Okay, that's enough walking around the outside of the building. Let's head inside the store. And I'm going to show you every single Star Wars piece of Lego for sale here at the Disney Springs Lego Store. It didn't take long to find the first Star Wars section. It was right on the right hand side of the store as we walked in. Just past all the Ninjago and the Marvel sets. Get ready because I'm going to show you every single Star Wars Lego set in this section. We're going to start off with two different helmets for $69.99 each. Moving down here for $34.99, you can build Yoda's Jedi Starfighter. Two different young Jedi Lego sets are available here. Very cool that they have Lego product for this brand new show on Disney+. Plus. You can build the Mandalorian Starfighter for $59.99. The ATT -E Walker set. Moving over here, look at this. Look at this Star Cruiser. It's very cool how Lego shows off some finished product. For $649.99, you can build this at home. I know you thought that price was high, but wait till you see this. The Ultimate Collector Series Millennium Falcon. This is 7,541 pieces. And it's going to run you $849.99. You'll notice the exclusive tag and a lot of the big ticket items are non-discountable. Back to a little bit more reasonably priced sets. This set is fantastic for $169.99. Look at all the different minifigures you get. For $15.99 each, you can go home with a Boba Fett or a Darth Vader mech set. I don't know about you, but these give off Transformers vibes to me. Up here we have this gunship that we saw a bit earlier that was pre-built for $139.99. Down here is another Star Wars Collector Series set. The AT-80. 6,785 pieces. This AT-AT set is going to run you $849.99. Wow. Here's a look at a couple more pre-built sets that they're showcasing. Another Mandalorian set. This one comes with Grogu. Here we have another Ultimate Collector Series, the X-Wing Starfighter. This set is only 1,949 pieces. And it'll run you $239.99. Here's an iconic Star Wars moment. The Endor Speeder Chase for $79.99. 608 pieces. 
this 625 piece Thai bomber set will run you $64.99. The Executor Superstar Destroyer set didn't have a price on it. But down here is my favorite set I've seen so far. The Emperor's Throne Room from Return of the Jedi. This 807 piece set will run you $99.99. Here's the first set featuring Ahsoka. The Ghost and the Phantom 2. 1,394 pieces for $159.99. A couple of Clone Trooper and Star Trooper sets sprinkled in for $19.99. And another mech set. Like the Boba Fett and Darth Vader, you can have a Storm Trooper mech. Another section of the pre-builts. And here you can see two of the mechs. They absolutely remind me of Transformers. A couple more Mandalorian sets. And down here, here's a big one. The Justifier set. 1,022 pieces for $169.99. And rounding out the Star Wars Lego set section... Two more sets from the Ahsoka show. Thanks for sticking with me this far in the video. That was a ton of Lego sets to review. But check this out. For $5.99, you can leave with a Lego minifigure keychain. Of course they have Star Wars ones. Fennec Shand. Here we have a Scout Trooper. The detail is amazing on these keychains. Next to the Scout Trooper, Ahsoka. And the last Star Wars Lego minifigure keychain they have available? Of course, everyone's favorite, the Mandalorian. Right next to the keychains, more Star Wars Legos. This time we have the Brickheads. The first Brickhead we're going to take a look at is Ahsoka. Ahsoka must not be a popular one because it's on sale for only $6.99. Below the Ahsoka Brickheads is a two-pack of Obi-Wan Kenobi and Darth Vader. This two-pack is priced at $19.99 for the set. Now at the top of the section, they do showcase a Tusken Raider. I wasn't able to find that one here. But that's priced at $9.99 if you can find it. Next to the Tusken Raider, they have the Obi-Wan Kenobi and the Darth Vader 2-pack Brickhead set built. Let me know in the comments what you think about the Brickheads line. I'm kind of on the fence with them. Our last stop in the Lego store is going to be the back wall. Now, I know this isn't exactly Star Wars Legos. But what if you have a Star Wars set and you're missing a piece? You can come here to the Disney Springs Lego store and purchase as many different pieces as you need. Two different options. This small box will cost you $9.99 and you can fill it up with as many pieces as you can fit. If that's not enough Lego, you can purchase the large box. Fill this large box up with as many Lego pieces as you need for $17.99. Before we head out of here, let's take one final look at this massive Lego store nestled right in the middle of Disney Springs. Remember, you do not need a park ticket to come visit Disney Springs, and parking is always free. Thank you so much for hanging out tonight and taking a tour around the Lego store to check out all the different Star Wars merch. I had no idea there were that many sets, and my gosh, they can get expensive. Not only the sets, they also have the keychains, the brick heads, and if you're missing a piece from some of your existing Star Wars sets, they have that whole back wall with every possible piece you're looking for. But again, thanks so much for hanging out. On your way out, remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you always know what's new on the two, living the magic, See you next week.